It's like dark, dark. Not supposed to be. It just fell. Uh, somebody get in the house rebuilt? Or like, what the fuck was that? That's a change. Okay, hold on. Let's just. <laughs> just kidding, guys. It's like really dark. I could see, but I. I could see, but anyway. The quality on my laptop is fucked. It's horrible. Like in order for me to look alright, I would have to be ring light on a thousand percent or somewhere where I'm all right in. And I don't have time right now because there's a lot going on around me. So, gotta make it work. And I've always wanted to do a blackout reading, like completely blackout. So, I guess it's this is my blackout reading. But we got high honor that it's in reverse. So either someone may be thinking about taking someone's high honor away from them, the respect that they have for them, or somebody wants to do that to you. You may feel like you're going to be in a mental imprisonment when it comes to some type of situation that's involving some type of unexpected income, but you're not. What the hell? Give me another card when it's coming out this high honor. For some of you guys, you don't even know the high honor that you have. And you're in this mental imprisonment. And it's like stopping you. Okay, because it's like whatever you're thinking is not that. You're thinking the worst. You're thinking the bad. You need to be thinking positive about it. Uh -huh. if you, you, the way that you're thinking negative, you can take your own high honor away from you. And you can, like, you can make the whole situation go back with the way that you're thinking. That's kind of how I'm kind of getting this. And then we got toll and labor again. Like, you may be going through toll and labor, or you may be putting yourself through toll and labor. You may even get a message about a mature woman that has been putting you through some type of toll and labor. Purposely. And it's over a wealthy man that may be in bad health. Okay. I don't know what this is about. It seems like there's some money assets involved. It has to be for somebody to be, it sounds like tormenting you the way that they have been. For some of you guys, somebody could be wondering why they are leaving something down to you. Yeah, we got marriage in reverse and child. There's a child involved and there's a marriage or there's a divorce. Someone could be thinking about a divorce, but they're thinking about the child. Somebody could be, y'all yeah, get what I'm trying to say. Is it the ex-wife? Somebody don't like the fact that somebody else could be around. They could be um, entitled to something. Oh, it's too many. What was this? We got gift, yeah, because somebody has a gift for somebody. Somebody got a gift for somebody. But somebody else don't want you to have this. What is this? You the side piece. That's what it seemed like. When the wands are, what's going on? Give me clear eyes. What's what is going on? What this collective or what? Ace of Swords. Some type of truth and clarity is about to come out. About somebody holding back up a message. Page of Pentacles in reverse, trying to stop somebody from going off and starting something new or learning something new, or receiving or giving a message or some type of help about the four of wands but it's four cups so somebody feels seven of pentacles in reverse so this person may this person may be in the commitment but they feel like it's a waste of time it ain't getting nowhere it was a bad investment you may feel like this is a bad investment will be a waste of time because of the fact that somebody 
you know somebody has somebody. It has taken you a while to realize this with this hangman that's right up under this four walls. But, um, you know now. And there's some type of injustice shit going on with justice in reverse right on top of this four wands. Page of Cups, use your intuition. The world, you, you feel like you have to wrap this cycle up. Spirit is pushing you to wrap this cycle up. Yep, and then right in front of the world is two of Cups in reverse. It needs to be done. It needs to be done. But the crazy part is somebody for sure has something for you. But oh, you might not even be sad. <laughs> now for some of you guys, this person may be one to try to give you something, but whatever what they were gonna give you, I don't think that you were gonna even let me not even go that far. But Ace of Pentacles, Five of Swords, it's some trickery going on. Page of Wands in reverse. Empress in reverse. Five of Cups. King of Cups. For some of you guys, you are one, it's a woman and it's two males. For some of you guys, if you are a male and it's two women, but somebody is not you and they are thinking about how they gonna um they gonna do to you. Man, I'm being honest. To stop this gift from coming to you. Somebody in the past don't realize it's over. It's done. A wife or an ex-spouse, husband or I I don't know who is it's somebody. Else. Oh, you guys, Mercury retrograde is over. What's going on with the planets? This is when the astrology, I need a something's going on. Because it's a lot of my readings lately has been people not wanting to let go of people. Like none whatsoever. And I feel like this is like hidden. It ain't really being shown publicly. People ain't talking about what they've been on. Ten of Cups in reverse. So somebody is, is for sure a relationship or a family dynamic. Ten of Swords. Ten of Swords. So somebody is devastated over the fact that they got to end this situation or this situation is ended. There's some secrets that's coming out about somebody and what they did with some finances, resources, or time that's been wasted. Somebody else feels like they want to work on it, but you may feel what you feel like. You said, now they only want my help because of the clout, my success, my recognition. This person is, one of these people is stressed out because they felt like they've been loyal to you. Even if they was cheating, they feel like they was loyal to you in other ways. Four swords in reverse. This person could be in bad health. Or somebody is stressed the fuck out. They really stressed out. Look, the lovers and two of pentacles in reverse. Cause somebody, y'all, like, what do you mean? What do you mean you're going or leaving? And I, oh, they don't understand. Two of wands, we get prepared. So this person could even be coming back to you, letting you know that they're completely done with their situation as well, too, that they had on the side. They left their family. Somebody might even be getting a divorce for you. Ugh. What's this Ace of Swords? Page of Pentacles in reverse. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Wait a minute. I meant to say Ace of Swords and Page of Pentacles in reverse. Did I say that? But anyway, Ten of Pentacles in reverse, which is... um. A divorce, an ending to a family dynamic, somebody wondering if it was even worth it, all that they have accomplished. This could be a business going down, not doing so well, but I think this is a marriage or a relationship. 
this may even be a family dynamic where this family is realizing they um, what they did by holding back from someone not letting someone know something this could even be somebody like a family dynamic tried to hold somebody back from starting a new venture a new uh, another adventure like when it comes to outlets to get money out like whatever that is some type of business adventure whatever what that you was doing because they may have not been in total agreement with that but now they see how they um they shouldn't have done that at all it was a very bad idea <laughs> it held them back Right. I'm always saying this. People come into realization that they just held themselves back. Ten of Cups in reverse again. Oh my goodness. The moon and two of swords in reverse. So secretly it is like someone's family could even be secretly splitting apart. Like this is clear as day. Out of jealousy. Nine of Cups in reverse. It's a lot of hidden jealousy judgment in reverse like people are not using their judgment but right up under the ten of cups in reverse is the king of cups in reverse so somebody is like emotionally detached cold hearted they damn six of swords six of cups in reverse king of wands in reverse temperance king of swords queen of pentacles and then we got four of swords in reverse, four of wands in reverse. Like, what the fuck is this? Losing all hope and all faith. But trying to, because it's like somebody trying their hardest to hold it together and do the right thing. Although this person is emotionally detached and cold hearted, you know the role that you play in this dynamic, in this situation. So you're trying your hardest, but you know for a fact. Somebody is cold-hearted and manipulated, like very much. And you know that somebody is not to be trusted. They're a liar. They don't take action. You may even know that this person is like living behind you somewhat. Like you gonna, you're gonna be taking up the, the slack of all the bullshit. It's all gonna be falling on on you. They don't date independent women because they can't manipulate them. This makes a whole lot of motherfucking sense. Yes. Okay, so you... This person likes to manipulate people. They like to control people. And... I feel like you are somebody that is naturally submissive. You naturally play that role. So they feel like, but at the same time, you're not stupid and you're not dumb. I don't know. Let's just keep going and seeing because I want to say a lot, but I don't know why I'm holding myself back don't let that no stop you so when did you get a no divided to conquer or trying to somebody's trying to divide split some shit up they don't want you to okay and I had to keep up because there's a family dynamic in here and then there's this family dynamic could just be from the lover. The lover that had the family dynamic that put in the family up. It, it may even be you going through a divorce. Because you know it's somebody else in the picture. And on top of that, this person may not want you to do whatever it is that you do for work. Now, for some of you guys, this was your family that tried to divide you and your person up. To, yeah. Oh my goodness. Can it be some new energy? 
redirect that energy. <laughs> That shit, it just be so funny to me. And I want to show y'all. But y'all can kind of... Anyway, it's a redirect that energy. Because I did not say, can we get some new energy anyway? So, for some of you guys, Spirit is trying to guide you to redirect your energy from these people. From this person. This type of person. Because you know that they know you're low i feel like you they know you loyal so whatever however way they read and go from whoever they know that they, you're gonna stay loyal and you're gonna do the right thing but this i feel like staying loyal is you know staying loyal to this is not the right thing you can't you can't stay loyal to this this is gonna stress you out and make you sick to your stomach and bring you all type of problems you don't need that Shake that bad energy off of you, okay? Dance, laugh, cry, sing, eat, do something. And then we got doctor, jealous as fuck. So some of you guys, you have somebody that's a doctor in your family or work in the medical field. They're jealous as fuck of you. Or you may be the doctor and they're jealous as fuck of you because you're the stable one. If you're a doctor, you 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 stable for the most part. I feel like for the most part your bills is paid. You might be behind on some some some, you know, like car credit cards or whatever, whatever. But for the most part, you I feel like you're you stable more than anybody else in this family dynamic. Okay, and I pulled my card that I was about to write, let them depend on whoever they left you for, but it stopped at who? Because this clearly they didn't they didn't leave you. They were still dependent on you. And they're going to be dependent on you. Because you let them be dependent on you. I feel like you're going to let somebody. We got an end in their future. Anger issues. Oh my goodness. And then we got those frowns are about to turn into smiles. So for some of you guys. This could be somebody in your family. That you just know you got to like always be around. But it's something about Okay now So if this is dealing with your family dynamic That you gotta be around somebody You might gotta be around this person And just knowing what type of person that they are It's somebody that's jealous of you Because somebody may even know that you're in someone's will Because Ten of Pentacles That's also like will insurance Inheritance you may be in somebody's like inheritance or like in their will okay and someone may know may not want you to be in that okay someone may even be like really try to have like debate on trying to get you out of uh, okay and it might be an ex lover you might have a child with like it might be their lover that you have it. You y'all get what I'm trying to say. For some of you guys, it's a child. I had a reason like this before. They stink by insulting you and make you go. Okay, so because it's back to they're trying to insult you to give up on. I'm guessing this is your gift or your business, but you're not. They're just jealous. With the, for some of you guys, someone is... Okay. This is one of these people. Let me just read this card before I say that. I was about to say. If they don't follow the crowd, you might get lost in it. For some of y'all, y'all dealing with these type of people. This person feels like you don't deserve to be in the will because you already got money. You already stable. Especially if you are in doctor. Now, if the doctor is jealous of you, then they just crazy. They just jealous. But especially if they got their own they stuff together. But anyway, if somebody feels like you don't deserve this because you already will. What does you... What does that have to do with this person wanting to give you or something? Because they feel like you deserve it. Like, why don't they got their things together? They just... So, so you... That sounds even crazier. So, it sounds like they're waiting for this person to die to get this gift. And that's probably why this person gave you this gift. Because they see you're not even like that. 
You work hard. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I just that. Ooh. And I feel like you somebody that don't follow the crowd. That helping hand might have a taser in it. This person may come off like a friendly person or try to act like they cool with you, but you know they're not cool with you. They don't really mess with you. You might need to take a break from listening to readings for a while. For some of you guys, you've been listening to readings a lot. I'm trying to figure out this situation, but I feel like this situation is going to come. The answers are going to come within. Because I feel like you're going to have to deal with somebody in a certain way. Only you know how you get in and out. You're going to have to get in and out with them. Like, it's, you're never going to find your real concrete answer through a reading okay and I, it, you see sometimes when I do readings it might be the same message but it'd be like different little cards coming out but it'd be around the same thing and they don't really give much because somebody could be looking for answers and again the answers is within you only you truly know what to do with your situation because again these aren't personal readings you know but when you're a good reader, you're a good reader. And you can pull on it. But at the same time, it's not a personal. So I can't. Don't. No. Uh-uh. High Priestess, act like you know. If you knew better, you would do better. You know what's going on, High Priestess. The test. Come on now. Stop playing with me. So you know what to do or how to handle these people. Or this, you know what to do. Alright, I love you guys so much. Take care.